goodness, you're all over the place right here. Yes, yes, I will tame all of you. Oh my lord, oh my god. Yes, all of you. Yo, guys, what is up? It's Teach here, coming at you again with another video, and I have an awesome one for you today. So, this is a location where you can tame a never-ending supply of, you don't even have to trap them, Sonoma crops. Literally the easiest thing in the entire world. If I just scan around, I'm just gonna go ahead and, like, show you how much they exist around here. It's kind of hilarious, in all honesty. Um, because like you go around and you'll see them all over the place. There's one right there. There's one right there. They're hostile apparently right now. Um, you can see that one's friendly. Um, but they are everywhere. There's three right there. They're, they're literally all over this place. Now where they spawn is kind of nice. But what's even cooler is there's a cave right behind me right now. And I'm going to go ahead and show you what's inside this cave and the cords just so you can see it right now. 56.2, 44.7. You just get to this water right here and you go into the cave. Now, you wouldn't think there would be too much in there, but unfortunately there is. Well, I mean, fortunately for this case, because inside the cave, even more so than on the outside, there is a huge number of Sonoma crops. I think there is an, you can already see them as I pass this corner over here. Now this isn't single player. However, I have tested this on official settings and stuff like that. They are literally everywhere. They get stuck in here. I think there must be a spawn point somewhere around here on the inside of this wall because if I've gone in this wall before, sometimes you'll see them like in the wall over here. But there is a ridiculous number inside this little mini cave right here. Uh, yeah, that's a cool screenshot actually. Um, so what you can do with this is uh, you just use it to your advantage. Now there's a few spots because people are like, you can't tame them if there's something above you. Well, inside of a cave, usually there's a few spots you can stand where you can actually hide and they will be able to land next to you. So they will attack you sometimes, unfortunately, but they do come back and get like peaceful. That's a 150 right there. Uh, it must be outside to tame. So you've got to find the right spot. Now, there is a few spots in this cave where you can do this. Now, what, the easy way to aggro them all is to get up right next to them. And uh, if they're kind of flying into the wall like this, they will eventually show up and say hi. But you have to like kind of wait for them. So they are all over. You can see they're coming and saying hello now. And then I'm going to stand like right about here. And this is usually a good point. You gotta be a little bit out of the water, but not totally out of the water, and they will come up to you, and you just have to get the right spot. Now it's just a waiting game of when they actually choose to say hello to you. Um, they tend to run for a little bit, but when they do come back, it's an easy, easy tame. So, uh, yeah, nice little tip. And obviously there's a bunch outside the cave that you can also bring into the cave so you can safely tame them, because they can't leave unless they happen to get the perfect route out over there. They will just get stuck in the wall like you see right here. They are in love with me. They are on their way back. And they should land right here in front of us. And you can see I'm in a spot where I can feed Kite and tame him. And we now have a Sonoma Crops. Not too shabby. We'll tame this guy too. Oh, you want to get tamed as well? Okay, cool. Let's feed you. And you can see, check this out. So it's going to feed it. And he's going to do his little runny thing. But we're still close enough to him where he's still going to come back and get tamed by us. So pretty freaking useful so they'll just continue to do this um, and you can tame a ridiculous number and again the person that found this was kaya on fire um she she has been taming them like this for a while i just wanted to show you guys a pretty easy strategy and where to get it and all kinds of stuff so pretty neato so i will tag her video in the stuff below but this is an awesome little location make sure you check her video out as well so anyway, hopefully this helps you out. You can see these guys are coming to get some more tames as well and some loving. But there's a lot of loving about to happen. Hello, my goodness. You're all over the place right here. Yes, yes, I will tame all of you. Oh my lord. Oh my god. Yes, all of you can get tamed. All of them. Chitin for you, and you get chitin, 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 and you get chitin. Oh, I tamed that one. And you get chitin, and I tamed that one too. Oh, nice. So anyways, uh, you can see that is not too shabby. Pretty awesome. So hopefully this helps you out and teach. Bye.